Hello everyone, uh, I would like to explain in this short video how to check your Avalanche network wallet to see if it, your wallet is safe from airdrop scams or not. Alright, so what could happen with an airdrop scam is that you connect your wallet to a website and then the website asks you to be able to spend your tokens and if you uh, let them disapproval, then they can take tokens from your wallet. And uh, even if you did this, uh, you can fix your wallet by going to Snowtrace, right? Your your tracking website. It's a it's a fork of Ether Scan. So you go, you click to more, and then token approvals. And what you do here is you enter your wallet address. So I quickly uh, search for someone's wallet address. It's not mine. Uh, and you, then you click on the search button and what happens is that uh, it searches for all the smart contracts all the tokens that you have in your wallet and then it uh, searches for approvals of each uh, contracts right and then what you want to do is basically uh, hopefully your list is not this long but basically there will be a few uh, trusted websites that you can trust right so for example if uh, if here you have a a usual dex that you go to like trader joe for example or yeti swap uh, that you trust then uh, it, it will be able to take tokens from your wallet and uh, if you see here something like an approved spender like this right uh, that is an unknown wallet address that uh, or a it's not a wallet, it's a smart contract, then you might want to basically revoke the uh, approval for it. And what, how you do that is there is this button called Connect Web 3. Once you click that, uh, you know, you can select your, your wallet and connect it, right? And, uh, and then you revoke the, the approval. And once you did that, uh, then the scammer cannot take your tokens from the wallet anymore. You might want to do that. Uh, you want, might want to check this regularly, right? And there is not really a downside of uh, of revoking uh, any contracts that you are, you don't recognize, basically, because let's say you you accidentally you know take take this line for example sushi token. Oh, that's a pangolin router. You you accidentally revoke this, uh, this approval then the next time while well, you want to trade this token on the on the website it will just ask for your approval again so there is not really a downside of uh, revoking these approvals only you have to pay the gas which but i guess it's not too much in the in the avalanche network so it's safe to remove all of this right and i actually suggest to check this uh, if you are interacting with websites very often you might want to see what they actually did that like what uh, sort of trace are they living here and any websites that you heard they have been hacked or or, or you know like um, the the developers went rogue and uh, rock pulled or something like that you might want to revoke those contracts so i hope you enjoyed this video Wish you safe trading.